Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Star Renegades tonight. Intervening time. My controller turned off. So that's fun. Um, so we got deeper into our second run last time. Um, I don't remember exactly where we uh, set down for the night, though. So as soon as I get my controller back up and running, we can check in on it. Oh, man. Um, but I know folks got levels up, and we got, uh, some new equips and all that, too. I think we got a new party member. I don't remember if we're at some... There we go. If we're at the end of our, uh, second area, or just started the third, or maybe we're at the end of the third area, too. Ooh. Who really can tell in this day and age? Start my controller thing one more time before we get started. There. Okay, uh, let's see where we're at. I think we left off in the middle of a, well, at the end of a, one of our days here, right? So we should be, are we headed into? No, we must have just started Area 3. Yeah, we're at the end of the first day in Area 3, so uh, we were just about to make camp here. I think we got everything pretty much needed. Everybody should be pretty well full health, though. Well, mostly. Most part, at any rate. Uh, okay, let's see. What did we just gain? Shield defense and shield piercing, it seems pretty sick. Um, auto shield regen seems good as well. Man, the Aegis has a lot of cool stuff. Um, I would love to have, like, a very light heal, though. If anybody that's got... Oh, well, here. Got an heal. That's probably gonna be worth it, so we'll do that. And a little bit of extra shield defense. Um, attack straining shields would be alright, too. That doesn't quite put him at... Two. How about attack speed? That's pretty, uh... Attack speed is pretty nice, too. Um... Yeah, let's do faster attack speed, and then we get two additional points to use. Could just do the last one, and I think that gives us the combo attack. So, uh... That might just be worth it. <laughs> It might be worth it just for grins, honestly. Or we could do. I do like attack speed, but I also do like uh, it's like a one pointer, and then there's a 50% armor repair. Otherwise, there's this. Oh, damn. Too bad that we're not going to get the combo out of that one. I'd be interested in what their combo move is going to be. But uh, since we're here with this one, anyways. Uh, is it drain sh Do we want to do drain shields, or do we want to, like, do the return? Attacks can cause bleeding. Because that's a one-pointer, right? So we could do that, and then we could do... Armor repair. And, or this. Additional damage for marks. Uh, you know what? Let's do... This one. Attacks cause bleeding, right? Plus, we'll get their combo move, which is stun. It's only a single target, which kind of stinks, but it's a stun, and it's, you know, pretty good damage, like 250 damage, right? So, I don't mind that. Um, and now we can do, let's see, that's one for three, or we can do one for five. Who's got... Okay, we can do slight armor repairs here. Yeah, let's do that. And they're pretty close to getting their combo move. If I could get that before we face the big bad. Um, oh, there's another little thing here, too. Um, I don't mind probably checking that out. But I think we'd probably be best off 
maybe fighting this guy first. Um, how's everybody's level? <laughs> we at, uh, oh, we are only at, uh, like, level sixes mostly across the board. Maybe we should do this one first, then. I think this is essentially a free act. We go in and kick some ass. Alright, we should decide what we're gonna do, because there's some extra... Extra level up juice over on that side. There's also whatever is that. Oh, that's nothing. And there's extra level up juice over here. Oh, I see. Um, so we could do the fight, and then extra level up juice, and then the fight here. And then equips, and then... Oh, that's a level 8 at the end there. Uh, hmm. That might be ill-advised. No, I think either way we'll... Go up the middle. It's a... Maybe not necessarily a free fight, but it should be a doable fight. I don't like that he gets to go first, though. <laughs> uh, can we maybe not have him do that? By doing a massive stun attack. Seems good. Um, what else do we have? Oh, we've got this, too. That's not a stun attack. But it's a pretty big hit. But, you know what? We're gonna use our stun attack immediately on this guy. He's gonna be nearly toast. Pretty good. Okay, and now we just need to deal with the other two. Um, do we have anything else that we can use to target the back row dipshit there. We really not have anything else that can hit that back row? Oh, there. That guy. But that's not enough. Just barely not enough. Can we really not? Okay, that doesn't move him back at all. Because what is, what is that? What attack is that? Oh, that's an AoE. Oh, wow. That's a big AoE. I hate it. Uh, okay. It's the closest we're going to get there, but it's not going to... I really don't have any other AoE, do I? Hmm. Up there. I can do that. But if I do... Okay, that's not going to be enough to... Oh no, Shield Pro is the one I was thinking of, was it? Or is it Smash? I think Shield Pro is the only one that'll hit the back row there. So otherwise, I mean the other... Okay, that does a stun. Oh, but it doesn't fucking... I can't hit the back row with it. What the hell, man? Damn it. <laughs> I hate it. Uh, okay. If I could somehow... Can I get this dude in two? I could murder this dude in two. Then we could maybe hit the back row dipshit. But I don't think that's gonna be enough. Oh, and that wouldn't even be in time anyways. Damn, I really don't have... ...enough to get that guy, do I? Well... shit.
Mm, none of these are like ultra free actions here either. Except for no, not one of these things is a free action. Is it not? No, it is. There, that one is. Ah, maybe I shouldn't have wasted my one, uh... Shouldn't have wasted my combo move. Can I... Hold on a second. Is there a... I feel like there was a rewind... Somewhere. <laughs> that we could restart the battle. Ah, uh, maybe I should... I should... Nah, let's not do that. We'll just deal with the consequences here. That's fine. This, damn, this guy's got too much stuff. So unless I do, like... It's how fast is her thing? It's, n it's not that fast, but I need it to be, like... Slightly faster, maybe. Um, God, not even that's gonna do it. He won't be dead quick enough, anyways. He'll be stunned, which doesn't really help my cause. Pierces some armor. Gets rid of all of his shields. Does like a very tiny amount of health damage. I guess my other option is to just go on the defensive and hope that next turn we can do this, but. Hmm. Wait, do we have a thing that... here. Does it marked? Marked shot on that guy, and that... Uh, what does that do? Uh... Minus quarter defense versus crits. Extra quarter versus marked. Well, if we do that, we do this, will that be enough? I don't think that'll be enough to really make any sort of difference. Damn, I'm kind of up a creek here. They are going to all take a big hit from this guy. They're all going to take a big hit, but if we can get them to not... I guess we'll just have to take the hit. Because as long as we're not... Yeah, I guess it's really just my back row that's going to take a bit of a health bop on it. Front row will be fine, because they got plenty of shields. Back row is going to suffer a bit. Um, so maybe instead... Guard all allies. She'll, she'll take a massive shield hit. But maybe that's mostly from this guy and not from... Yeah, that might be the thing to do. So that takes effect almost immediately. Yeah, let's do that. And then we can work on uh, getting this dipshit out of here. He's already kind of out. Okay. No 
if we do that. I think everybody move. Oh, except for that. Uh, you know what? Let's move a little bit faster then before. Poor idiot in the back gets to go, and then that'll prevent take quite as much damage, I guess. Probably the best we can go for. Sack gets him out of there, he's now also on fire. Takes a fairly large hit there. And on fire again, and then boom bam boom bam boom. Pretty good. Pretty good absorb there. Oh, I don't like what, what's going on there. Oh, I definitely don't like that. Now he gets to go pretty much freely, but he's going to last, so... We'll see what we can do about this. Can I still not? I can't. still can't attack the back row. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, well. Yeah, shit. The only thing I can do... Do I have a different stun? Like, I could do this again. Oh, she's not even gonna... Okay, so... That's just gonna stun her for the round, right? So maybe that's not so bad. If she goes first... If I could get her to go first, it's not gonna matter that much. She goes immediately here. That'll reduce the amount of damage she takes. She's already gone. Um, and then we can really just... Crush, kill, destroy, more or less. It's gonna be a late kill? What do you mean, a late kill? Oh, right, because his counter will kill that. Uh, I don't really care about that, do I? Oh, I guess I could do a stun here. Um, didn't I have something that could target a dude? Nice oh, stealth. How much is that doing? That's doing a lot. That's 203. Goodness. Um, that's a lot of damage. They just go all out on a combo. I can't do that one again, though, huh? Can only do that once? Kill there. Easy kill shot there. Okay, so just make sure he goes away very soon. And then whatever this is gonna hit. Like, I don't know who this is gonna. I guess it'll target that dude. I wish I could stun this fucker, though. If I defend, that'll be even less damage. I don't have anything... Do I not have anything that can target that? Dingleberry, that stealth Dingleberry. Aside from this, really, but it's too late for that. I guess the only other option is to be like, hey, let's uh, try to murder everything before that guy gets to go. I don't think is gonna happen, so I think that guy's gonna get to go. I don't like it. Alright, I guess we just gotta go for it. Go for it! Maybe defend. 
and then maybe... Oh god, that's just gonna take all of the damage, essentially, right? But there's a charge shield, which is plus 88. Which just seems like a good time to do it. Get our shields back and then garden? Ooh, that's still taking a pretty big bomb. I am curious, if I do that... If I do that, he doesn't need to defend, right? Because that doesn't reduce the amount of incoming damage to her if she's guarding him, right? That seems still like the best way to go. Plus, I could do another charge shields thing next round if I needed to, I think. So why don't we do that? Um... That dude, I think, is gonna die no matter what. Then, realistically, it's... I don't know what happens to... I don't know who gets hit by this. I don't know who this guy's targeting. Oh, yeah, that's not gonna be a problem. Alright, we'll see what happens. We'll see what the timeline of events is here. Okay, so he gets to go. Oh, no, she's stunned. Um, okay. I was like super dead there. It's weird. Oh yeah, then it hits the dude in the back, unfortunately. Okay, but that's fine. Took the bop, plus he dies because he didn't have much health to begin with. I'm into that, and now it's just this idiot, so uh, yeah, I think we're fine now. Now we just pretty much lay into them with everything that we have. I think no matter what happens, he's probably dead. There we go. Everybody gets to go before him. <laughs> so he's fucking toast. Oh, plus she's got... I forgot that she had a health steal on her. So that's even better. That's even better, really. Oh, these attacks will get us most of our fury back, too. Nice. Real good. Okay. Could've gone more poorly. Big level up juice gain. Would you like to see? Alright, so I can go either to the left or to the right. If I go to the right, I get an extra fight. Which I kind of need. kind of need extra fights to uh, help oh, my folks here. That was a lot of level up juice, too. Um, can we do maybe two levels up? Or hold on. What do we have for... Uh, Equip. So isn't there a better equip I could give to somebody? Oh, just slightly better level four blaster. Oh, got the uh, damage boost and other things. Yeah, okay. Equip that. Oh, I probably could have given given it to this guy too. Um. I kind of like the speed up there. Oh, that's right. He hardly had anything because I didn't. I couldn't afford to give him anything. <laughs> that's right. But more or less, she's fully kitted. Yeah. Okay. So we don't have anything. We're waiting on level ups to equip. are going to be better than the rest, but I do want to probably get to level 7s most of the way around here before we fight the, one of the bigger bads, right? That'll have to do there. I think one more fight will get one more level up, and then... Is that a level 8 or a level 7 at the end here? Level 8. Gross. Okay. Well, 
execute the deal. This fight should be probably a non-issue. Oh, it's five on five. That's fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> five on five, what can we do about this? Um, I don't like that he's got vengeance mode. We'll attack target if they attack. Well, we know what we can do about that. We can be like, no. You get your revenge shit cancelled, fuck you. Um, do we have enough attacks of everybody else to push everybody else back, though? It's really the two in the middle that I'm most worried about. So that one for sure. And I think Sunder for sure. Then uh, Broadside does 30 no matter what. Okay, and then this guy, which. Oh, he's got a really not great. <laughs> he's got a really not great one, but who, who is he firing against? Oh, just her. He's gonna do not very much the way it is, so. Okay. And, oh, he's, that's just gonna murder him straight up. Uh, oh, wait, what? Oh, that's the only dude that's not... Okay, wait, 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 wait. Who's attacking what? You're attacking that guy. You're attacking that guy. Okay, can we... Uh, maybe cancel that for a bit? Then we can just... Oh, I thought he was getting... I thought he was getting murdered. Okay, never mind. Um, cause it's just these other two that I need to worry about. Wow, are they all attacking my agents there? I think they are. Yeah, but if I can get like three of them gone, She'll be fine. Honestly, we do. Uh, actually, no. It's wrong one. Um, let's do uh, frontline dipshit here. Plus, then we can just. Uh, just make sure he dies. And then I think this for the back one, it'll cancel his Overwatch. I think. So we should be good. Everybody doing a thing? Alright. Now we just let it play out. Plus 11 fury balls. Thanks. And one of them dies entirely, so that'll be five on four. Okay, I don't mind that. I got 102 shield. She's got plenty of shield. No issues there whatsoever. I am a little bit worried about that dude in the back, though. So maybe we can just murder him. Um, can we go fast enough? Sever can only attack the front line. Or, that's not even a front line. Ugh. Okay. Well, can one of our... Damn, I was hoping that... Who's he even attacking? Oh, our front liner. Okay, so again, this is a case of... Yeah, they're all trying to focus her down a little bit. Oh, we just gotta make sure to kill the dude in the middle before he gets to go, really. So as long as she gets to go, maybe first? Oh yeah. That'll kind of tip the balance a little bit. Oh, they'll, they'll both be going now, because, uh... No, it'll be these two. 
kill and stun versus... Is that going to be enough to kill? No, it isn't. Of course not. But he's also firing at her, which might not be a bad thing. Either way, it's 20. I think it's 20 no matter what we do. Does everybody else have... Fast enough maneuver. I think just doing this is probably a good idea. Just murder the back row entirely. So he's gone. No need to worry. Uh, and now it's just a matter of let's ensure that everybody gets to go before they wish she had a faster attack or that somebody else could attack Push him back. Or we could do Fortress. Uh. God damn. Uh, what if we did charge shields and then Fortress? That's another 88. She'd be already taking up a pretty big hit, I think. But I think that's probably worth doing. Because then she's hardly taking any damage at all. And now it's a matter of, well, let's just. murder something, right? Make sure everybody gets to go before they do. It's probably fine. She probably won't even take uh, extremely full damage from this. Okay, a, a little bit of health damage, but that's fine. It's reflected some of it. Now we're back to just pummeling the crap out of everything. And we'll get a little bit of health back for this anyways, right? What's her, um... Uh... Uh, here. Can I look at her thing? Oh, I can't look at... Uh, uh... Yeah, damn. I can't look at her equipment to see how much health steal she's got. So realistically, maybe I just... do whatever. Whatever dude that guy hits is probably going to be dead, too. Ah, oh, man. It's a shame we're wasting a... Wasting a turn on that guy, then. <laughs> I mean, he's probably going to bleed out or whatever, um, but I think this guy's shot is going to probably eat him. Right? Oh, no. That guy first. Okay. Which is fine. Good. And he should be probably toast there. Yeah, super on fire. Okay. Now it's going to be a matter of, well, let's make sure our... Uh, Aegis gets to go, so she gets a little bit more health steal, right? Probably a smash, because that'll get her more health, perhaps. Then I think the rest really doesn't matter. Oh, nice. 40 health steal. Even better. I think she's probably back to full. Yep, well, more or less. 
should be enough for an additional level up, right? Somebody? Yeah. Now we got mostly sevens and one six. But we'll be fighting a level eight, so this might be a bit of a tougher go of things. It's five on four. And I don't like that he goes uh, cloaked. That's dumb. So that's no good. And he gets to do whatever. Oh man, that's almost gonna murder him in one. Uh, okay. Can we do anything about that? Can we hit him with this combo attack and stun him? No. Um... But we do kind of need to do that to, like, center sniper dipshit so that he doesn't get to go right away. Quite gonna kill him. Get close. I guess my other option is like, how much is that gonna put out? 254. <laughs> how much shield does she have? 209. So if I guard. Okay, she'll, she'll take a small bop to help, but she can make that back with an attack later. So it's probably good to guard him. And then we'll just do our. Big boom attack here to stun this fucko. It's mostly toast the way it is. Let's guard him, so whatever certain spike goes off, it's fine. Okay. hits he takes there. He's definitely on fire. Uh, 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 okay, yeah, that's fine, I guess. Anticipate that one. Good reflect there. That's most of her shield, but whatever. It's not quite dead. Oh, well. Hey, game over. How you doing? Good to see ya. Uh, okay. Oh, good. Now he's fucking invisible. Oh, <laughs> Damn it. Uh, alright. Well, what can we do about this? Ah, man, I've got no AoEs. This is what's kind of killing me here. Zero AoEs. I really do just want to cancel Overwatch on this one, really. That's a good opening gambit. I think. Because then, yeah. Because then we can now attack with more or less of impunity here. Um, so whoever's going to go first here... ...is going to kill... Frontliner, so then we can then we'll be targeting whomever really. I think I care about anything else because he's gonna be dead anyways. So probably best off just doing. Oh, it even tells me uh, 40 health, 20 health, 40 health. Okay. So 40 health recovery there. And then, you know, whatever we're gonna do here, it's probably fucking toast, and then... Oh, I guess he's gonna die. So two, two of those dipshits are dead, and then we'll just... take whatever we need to take on the chin. Oh, fine. These two fuckos. Oh, 186 is a pretty big hit. <laughs> ah. I don't like that. Um, 
I don't think we have much of a choice. Now, what can we do about that front side dipshit here? We can't push him back. We could stun him. I think, right? We could stun either of these fuckers. I don't want to stun back row dipshit unless we have to. Do we have any... Fast, fast attacks, like instant attacks. We can do that will murder him outright. Probably not. Well, unless we did the com combo. Combo might do it. Yeah, combo does it. And then we can just focus down back row dipshit. That might be worth it. That's 20 fury. I could otherwise just stun him for 15. How much does he have left? 188. Oh. What else do we have as far as like stun attacks are concerned? Got a stun there. That at least takes down more of his health. And then we might be able to focus down other things. Like we could just get that guy off the timeline, which is fine. You know what? Let's do. Uh, where's his. Where's my uh, dude stun here? That'll do more damage. It's cheaper. It's a cheaper attack, plus he's on fire, so we don't really need to waste very much. Can we... Yeah, we can just do massive big boom slam on back row dipshit there. Got two additions here. So, how much is he burning? Uh, only ten. That's unfortunate. So we're gonna have to do some damage to him. So I guess to make sure he dies, we could do that. Or we could just do really big attack here. Let's do that instead. Well, not really, really big, but big enough where it's going to do a significant amount. So bim, boom, bam. There's an extra 20 health, so she's back to full. Pretty big attack there. I didn't realize he was weak to normal attacks, so that's good. And then big boom slam. Oh, plus uh, armor absorb. That's great. Okay, so now he's nearly toast. Um, and we do have... Uh, I think this is going to be enough to kill him. Yep, so that'll be instant there. Fuck off. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, good stuff. And then it's just going to be... Big boom slam, normal attacks, and he's toast, four on one. <laughs> Plus whatever additional fury we can generate at this point, so there's another four. Excellent. Good stuff, good stuff. That was uh, maybe a bit costly for Budget Han Solo's health, but we get free stuff, and we should have enough. Do we have enough for another level up? We don't. We're one short. Bo! <laughs> Alright, um, so everybody's mostly level 7s. Yeah, we'll be just about at level 7. So what do we got? Ooh, aww. Oh. Heavy attacks execute instantly. Ooh, that seems fun. Uh, but it gets rid of the health steal. And it's also level 9, so it'll be a while before we can use it. Uh, so I might be better off getting just a better weapon for somebody, because there's plus 34% damage, my god. Oh, but also... Uh... Extremely quick. All attacks get 15, 15 seconds faster. That's kind of sick. Uh... <laughs> I like it a lot, in fact, but I do like the extra 10 second stagger, and honestly, the damage buff is probably better. 34% boost just across the board. Hmm. Yeah, I think I gotta go with that. Yoink. Alright, and that's that area. So really, it's only budget Han Solo who took... A couple bops 
on the chin there. So we might want to hold off on fighting this guy if we can, right? Where's the other, like, bigger... Okay, the other bigger dude's over there. Oh, and there. Uh, I'd really like to get all of these fuckers, but... We'd have to be... I guess we'd have to go up here. One, two, three to get that guy. Oh, he's also a level eight. Ah, I don't like that. This dude level seven? Oh, he's level nine. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, crap. Ah, uh, all oh, I'm not in good position to fight either of these big fuckers, really. Like I could do these two fights probably without much of an issue. That area is locked. So what can we do otherwise, though? Could we go around? We'd have to go around like all the way to this guy, I guess. So if we did that, if we did one, two, if we did these two, oh, that area's locked, never mind, I can't do that one. I'd have to do this one here. One, skip that for now, come back and do, I guess, two, three. And then Dawn of the third day, I'd have to do probably one, two, uh, I'd like to murder this level 9 dude, but I think he'd probably murder me. So that's probably a no. Um, and we can't get up to this guy, unfortunately. Unless we were to do... Oh, we have two battles to get to this thing. Oh, no. Alright. Well, you know what? Let's go through... Let's do this guy up here, because uh, that should be an easy-ish fight, I think. Oh, five on four. Five on four and nothing, like, terribly threatening. And realistically, we could do... So, who are our fastest folks here? Oh, that's just an insta-kill. Like, one shot, one kill. Uh, yeah, kinda into that. Just not even worry about it. Then we could probably ensure... Oh man, that guy's not gonna go out entirely, huh? else do we have that can maybe attack back row? Probably have to be this one. But, who's attacking who here? They're all... Okay, wait, which one was... Okay, dude in the back is, uh... doing big AoE. I don't like that. We gotta make sure he doesn't move. So maybe we do a stun, or like a big slam, just get him out of here. Eh. That seems good. And then the others we can just not worry about. They're both 20s, yeah. That's a late kill. What do you mean that's a late kill? Oh right, because he's going to be attacking and then a counter will take him out. Okay, you know what, let's not worry about him. <laughs> Fuck it. Wipe them off the field instantly. And we've got two additionals here. Which I would like to get pushed back first. And then we can do him almost dead, probably. Alright, yeah, so he <laughs> evaporated. <laughs>
Okay, pretty good, and he's burning. Is that going to be enough to... Point blank doesn't matter. She's got the shield to take it. Ouch. Also got the shield to take it. Yeah, all right, good. Now it's five on one. <laughs> now it's five on one. So this, this dipshit's gone. It even matters who does what and when. Third attack is gonna get get the kill, so probably our commando robot do that. Bonk. Okay, good stuff. Alright, then um What is this? If you defeat the nearby Warmonger Corps employee, this cave will free when night falls. Okay, so that'll be an extra little thing we can do after two more moves, which we can't go up there. But it's probably for the best that we open this up. So do we risk going after this guy now? be able to handle that. We're all going to be level 7. Probably. Yeah, we're all going to be level 7. Oh, no. I mean, what else can we do? Like, we can go around here and fight this. And then fight this. Um... Maybe we do these two fights? Like, these are much smaller fights. And then, Dawn of the Third Day, we can do this one when we're fresh. That might be the good play. And also, we'll have this kind of nighttime battle thing going on, so that's that's probably a better idea. Let's do that. It's a little bit cowardly, honestly, but... I don't like my chances with Budgeton Solo uh, pretty much toast right now, so do some of these smaller fights. We'll get some level up juice. We'll get somebody to level 8 or something, right? do a thing. Ah, uh, why is... Like, they're clearly still in the front row, sort of. Like, why can't we just... Who is he shooting at? Does it matter? As long as everybody goes? Oh, no, that'll be fine. Her shield will protect her. Okay, that's fine. May as well just wipe the floor with one of them, then. And whoever... It's nice and toasty here. It's probably fine, too. I guess we can take out a shield. Let's get our fury built back up, too. That's kind of... The important bit, since we've got a lot of equipment doing, like, extra, extra fury gains, really. Which is very important, as it turns out, since we do a lot of stunts. Okay, yeah, her armor protector, which is great. Oh, she took pretty good armor damage there, because it dumped the integrate bullshit. Don't like that. Okay, let's see what we can do here. It's kind of a back row thing. Do we have anybody... Okay, let's move some of these back if we can. Kill a shot there, I like that. Kill a shot there, I like that as well. 
And that's not going to quite push him off. You can just do that. That works too. I think the remainder, the other two dudes that are left on the timeline here are going to get murdered straight up. Uh, in fact, done the correct order of operations. That dude should be toast, yeah. And boom, 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 boom. He's done. And we've got five on one for this guy. Oh man, I always feel sorry for him. He's just gonna get waxed. I think we need to make sure this is in any particular order either. fight up there, it seems. Do we have an okay, we do have enough for another level up, so at least one of our folks is gonna be level eight here. Is it gonna matter which one? Do any of these or any of these an AoE? There, okay. AoE, there's an AoE. Oh, random. Random single target? That's weird. How about just normal ass AoE? Okay, this one. It's a very small amount of AoE. But, uh... Here's another different AoE. 29, and it cancels a bunch of stuff. Also does burning. Damn, that's pretty sick. Uh... But that also does bleeding and rattle 7. Oh, right, probably from his weapon. Okay, so we finally get some AoEs up here. Um, 29, 29, 14, 29, whatever, but that's also 29 AoE plus 40 stagger. Ah, that seems good. Gimme. Finally. Ah, you know, I rag on Budget Han Solo a lot, but he does some good work. Like, I can't complain about the work he does. Alright, there's just this dude here, really. Hmm, I don't like whatever dudes those are. Summon rockets seems bad. What are you doing? No, stop! Oh, oh what are you doing? Mm -hmm. Okay, suddenly it's six on five. <laughs> I don't like it. Why do they get to do all this stuff like right away? Fuck you! Oh god. Ah. Uh... Ah, jeez. Okay. Mm. Alright. Oh, what can we do to counter any of that? Where's our AoE? Oh, why can't we do that? Oh, do we need to maybe... Oh, I see. We need to do a plant explosive first. And then that lets us do either in a flash or detonate. Ah, crap! I guess we did have detonate as an AoE regardless, right? Okay. Uh, maybe I should have done one of the other ones then. <laughs> Too late. Okay, well, there are our options. So those two dudes are gonna go this turn regardless, I think. Try to focus down the dudes that are possibly gonna go this turn. Do big boom slam and just get one of these dudes off the table that eats two of our these turns there. Instead, do this a bit more carefully. Oh, interesting. We can actually break the rockets off the timeline, too. Or at least that one. 
don't know about the other one. The other one's not doing shit, apparently. Yeah, it's not. It's not doing anything, so I probably don't need to focus that one down. We do kind of break him off, and then be like... Uh... He'd do that. Oops! Ah, I forgot that's an instant. Well, never mind. I guess we're doing that. <laughs> I suppose that's going to be a kill shot without burning the fury for the, the big boom slam stun thing. So, you know, as well. And then we can make sure that that thing goes away. Or, either way, either way, it's gonna die, I think. Okay. Well, let's take this down to five on four. I do really miss our our combo AOE attack with um, I think it was Spiritual Robot Dude and our Pro Tag. That was a sick move. That did big damage across everything. Would have been very helpful for this fight. Okay, I don't give a shit that you're armoring up the rocket. Do I? <laughs> I hope not. Uh it's gonna attack now, which is bad, but I think for now it probably doesn't matter all that much. If we can. Oh, and it's got. Got a big damage to it. I don't like that. We can make sure it goes next turn. It doesn't go this turn. Might not be a bad idea. Can we do... Damn, I don't have something fast enough to get that other dude not in here. Unless... Unless we do that and just take him immediately off the... Off the battlefield here. Do I have any... Uh, I don't have any combo attack that doesn't involve... A budget hunt solo, fortunately. If anything that will do. Okay, we could do a stun. We could just do a stun and then a big attack to uh one sec. Do this to just wipe that off the field entirely and then do a stun on robot dipshit, right? So there goes that. Um, and then... We could do something to... To move him back enough that we might kill him. There we go. And then we've got... Whatever we've got here, right? Which isn't much. It's mostly gonna be shield damage. So 114 plus 40. Probably gonna be our best move here, so let's do that. Now we just have to deal with the two rocket summoning dipshits, which I'm hoping they're not gonna summon two additional rockets. I mean, that just delays the inevitable for them, but. Ah, uh, yeah, of course they're gonna do that. Okay. Oh, good, there's more of them now, too. Oh, good, great! Ah! Fuck! <laughs> oh, that annoys me. Okay, so just have to pick and choose which ones we're gonna target. So what do we what do we have here? We've got oh, 
budget on soul is gonna take a bop. Oh, that's AoE shit. Oh man, everybody's taking a bop. Okay. Ah uh, no. Well, that will at least take it off the board and do leading 15. How much does that have to begin with? 123. That's 108, 115, plus 15, so that's essentially done. Um, then we would really need to get this one off the timeline. If anything else that can... Anything that can just kill that one. I guess I could try for the AoE. So could we, in fact, do... Okay, that one's gone. Entirely. So then we only really need to target the other one. Which would be... Perhaps this? And also... Sunder, which would take it off the timeline, and then we could do explosives there for next turn. And that gives us one additional go to do something. I don't know, I guess take off. We can eliminate one of one more of these rockets just so they have less to work with next round. That seems good. Let's just get that one out of here. This one should be toast now as well. That's good. This one should also maybe be toast. Yeah, okay. That's two. And then these two get to go again. I don't give a shit whatever they're gonna do. It doesn't matter, because we're gonna pop our AoE grenade thing, and hopefully these other two rockets go the fuck away. Plus, the other two dudes take a big hit. So let's see. What is this gonna do? That's gonna do a lot. Um, that'll take most of them out. So let's just do that. Fuck you. Kaboom, bam, boom. One rocket goes, the other one's, you know, toast. Well, also. And then we get to do, uh, essentially four on two. Very good. There's a kill shot there. It's gonna more or less be a kill shot. There we go. Now we're pretty well good. Okay, so like they delayed the inevitable by two turns. Really think about what they've done before they get murdered. Good for them. Okay, uh, that's not going to be enough for another level up though, is it? But I'm glad we did that, because now... We can go up there and do some even more stuff. So there's more money. Uh, yeah, we need now triple digits for levels up. That sucks. Okay. Uh, ultimately, probably the better decision to go. Kind of everywhere but the big level 8 dipshit. Now we get to do a little bit of extra fight. I think this is going to be a few extra fights in here, yeah? Yeah. Which, uh, yeah, there's that dude there, which might be a problem. We'll see. Um, so what are we dealing with here? Uh, level 7. More level up juice. 
And I don't know what that is. That might be like another uh, character class unlock or something. That would be kind of sick. Level 7. Some shields and shit, which is fine, probably. Level 7 there. I think I'd probably be best off going to the north here. One fight, level up juice, two fights, extra money, and then the final fight. Oh, he's a level nine. Ah, that could be a problem. But it is the last kind of action before we have a camp out, so this this might be okay too. Plus, we'll have uh, whatever that's gonna be there. Okay. Well had to go to the north regardless. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, okay, he gets to go first. That's not really that fair, but thanks anyways. Um, okay. And if I read that correctly now, our robot commandos dude's attacks cannot stagger, so that's unfortunate. Okay, well, uh, that's a bit of a problem. Who's attacking who here? What's that doing? What's, I don't, I don't like whatever that attack is gonna be doing. <laughs> okay, because that's gonna do a bit of a health drain there. But honestly, the health drain attacks against our agents is not a problem since she's got health steal stuff anyways. So I like that. Um, Alright, this might not be that bad. We could do just a big boom slam and get one of these fuckers out of here entirely. Seems maybe the thing to do. And then we can work down whomever else here. Can we do more than 25? this. Yeah, that'll get that dude out of there. And then if we do Big Boom Slam on I guess this one is less of an, it's more of an issue than the other tiny robot dude. So it instantly makes it five on three. And then we've got one attack to do here, which is going to be, oh, just eliminate him entirely. All right, so then it's five on two. Uh, might be good. Yeah, let's do it. Just a little extra shield green, which is great. Okay, whatever health train he's gonna do against her Aegis, whatever, she'll just get it back next turn anyways, pretty much. I don't know what that did, but I don't like it. So we need to make sure he doesn't go this turn. Oh yeah, we got plenty of time to do that. We can just do instant big boom slam free shit right here. Um, and then just ensure that this guy probably gets toasted. Um, I am curious though. Yeah, yeah, there's a kill shot there. So then we can focus down this other guy, and he's more or less gonna be almost fully toast, but he'll he'll survive another turn. Hey, look at that, we got our health back. Um, he'll survive another turn, but then he's super toast. We'll have more or less full fury after this turn too. Boom, 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 boom. He's burning times three. Which is great. <laughs> Big slam there. Wow, that's thirty for burning. That's great. I think we're gonna have enough. Yeah, there's a kill shot already, so we're good. Probably a kill shot there. Um, and it's not really gonna matter who does what. Matter of who gets the kill. Full fury, no matter what. 
that death or is that oh he survives for one more attack robot commando gets the kill very good good fight all right so then we get some three level up juice 120 is pretty solid so that's probably two level up level ups then and then presume this is a character unlock Huh. <laughs> How long were you in there? So do we get this dude immediately or does he go back to like the command post and we have to recruit him next time? Uh huh, uh huh. Okay, now it looks like, uh, yeah, I mean, you again after you complete this plan. Okay. Very good. That's what I kind of figured would happen. All right, so now we've got enough for two level ups. Um, let's get our other two AoE attacks rolling here. Three level eights, two level sevens. Maybe another level 8 by the time we get out of here. Or maybe after we murder this guy. Oh! Two bigger idiots here. Damn it. Okay. Who else are you targeting with? Okay, good. Spread it around a little bit. <laughs> Asshole. Okay, no problem. Five on two, I think this is fine. We'll be alright. Um, okay. It'll be a matter of... Well, let's check out these other AoE attacks now. So, unload... Eh, pretty light. Light attack. Good armor damage on it, at least. Does a little bit of piercing. And it cancels a bunch of other shit. It's great. And the other AoE we got was on him, which is... Oh, it's random. Okay. So, it's a random single target, I guess. And it's a pretty slow attack, too. But even so, 153 is not sneeze at. Even if you can't control who it hits. Alright, well, that's good to know regardless, I think. Let's start with... Well, maybe we start with everybody else and see what else we can do. Maybe we can even focus down. Yeah, let's just do the rando AoE thing. One of these dudes is going to be able to go. I don't really care. <laughs> Honestly, I don't care. I don't care who gets to go. Uh, let's see, it'll be blah, 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 blah. Or we could do AoE. Okay, th this AoE doesn't do a stagger, though, does it? Hey, okay, yeah, none of his attacks. None of this dude's attacks do stagger. That's... Probably unfortunate, but we'll make it work. So four versus two and whatever. So that's more armor damage versus other damage and that pierces armor anyway, so let's do that. This rando AoE attack hits. Ah, that guy. Oh, he's almost toast. Oh, he is toast because of the fucking burning. Yeah, great. All right, even better. All right, let's make sure he essentially gets broken off this turn now too. Hey, that. If there's only one dude, that's going to be doing 153. Plus 76. It's, you know, okay. Why not? 
surprised. He's not gonna die this turn, but he's gonna be close to dead. I guess his armor is protecting quite a bit, yeah. Since that, I think, takes effect on every hit. Whatever he's got there. Oh, well, he's toast, I think. <laughs> Fuck you, idiot. Alright. 104, is that enough for a level up? No. We need 106. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Alright, whatever. We got here. Oh, nothing. Just flavor text. Okay, so I guess we get some extra money, and then we get... Or we could go down south. Where is, uh... What does this do? Oh, some extra level up juice. Uh, how much money we got? That's probably enough money. Let's get the level up juice instead. Seven is pretty good. Alright, so who gets it? Bunch of flurry attacks. 76 versus 122. It's mostly against shields. Okay, both of these are against shields. Well, I think mostly our other attacks from Protag have been used, so I wouldn't mind another attack option from Aegis. Of both of them. Okay, yeah, and that one's particularly slow, too, so let's do this one first. Now we get a bunch of level 8s. Only one level 7 remains. That'll inform our gear choice here once we beat the shit out of this. Oh, fuck. 5 on 4. Alright. Of course, they get to go first, so that's fun. Okay. Okay. Um, any AOE attacks going here? Not really. Oh, except that guy. All right. Well, can we? Yeah, we could use a combo and just wipe one of these two off the off the field entirely. Oh, he gets enraged, huh? What does he? What does he not like? When hit. <laughs> okay. You know what? That's fair. That's a fair cop. Um, oh, he regenerates a lot of shield every round. Uh, I hate it. Can't be debuffed. He's fast. Doesn't like concussion damage, though. I think, uh... I think Budget Han solo gets concussion, yeah? Yeah. But that's not gonna do very much. Maybe we wait. I don't. He's not even gonna. Uh, doing 136, which is kind of not great. But she's got 118. Only got 118 shield. Uh, all right. Well, what else can we do? Maybe ensure that. Maybe ensure that he doesn't get to go this round, and then we can do just a general kill shot here. Should leave then maybe that, and uh, it's still gonna be not enough. Be that. And then just do our wipe this front fucker off the face of this battle. Yeah. Because most of what we expended there for Fury is going to come back from the other three actions we do anyway, so... Honk bonk there. And then, you know, sort of big slam there. And then one more attack to... Oh, that's not going to push him off the timeline. Well, that's not the greatest. But he gets to go, which is... Oh, 51. 
Ouch. Oh, she's got a lot of health, though. She'll be fine. Okay. Now it's gonna be a matter of... Uh, just making sure... Nobody gets to go. Um, alright. Could just push him off right away. Is he not... Okay, let's make sure he gets out of here. Actually, that's not gonna kill him, huh? Make sure he dies somehow. That's not gonna push him back all that much. It's something real potent here. Oh, and it looks like uh, this dude might actually die, huh? Okay, well, let's make sure that doesn't happen. Hmm, is somebody doing an AoE here? Oh yeah, he is. Uh, okay, let's make sure he doesn't go. <laughs> Okay, let's make sure, yeah, he, he gets the fuck out of here. Well, I could push it back a bunch. And then just be like, yeah... Oh, no, I can't do that. Huh? Okay. Essentially make sure he doesn't go, and then... Ugh. Do I not have an, a, a thing that can target that other dude on the bottom there? Really? I really need to make sure he doesn't go. So he's got the, the big boom AoE going on here that I don't like. And also I don't want that guy to go either. So uh, maybe we do a stun or two. And if we're going to do a stun or two, we may as well just be like, hey, you uh, let's get out of here. <laughs> he's going to be enraged versus stun versus whatever from taking an attack, right? But he also regens shield and shit, right? That's the deal? Uh, okay, so maybe we ensure... Let's see, where's your... Okay. This would eat a lot of our fury. If we did two stun attacks... Okay, this would break him off entirely for now. And then we could do the two. Do that stun attack there, and we've got a stun attack. Oh, we can only target the front room with that one. Ah, I hate it. Um, do we have anything else that does a stun besides that one? Alright. So, who are we really stunning now? It's stun those two, and then it's just this dude going. At which point we could do... Guard our front runner. She gets to go without issue. Uh, maybe stun dipshit one there and stun dipshit two here. Do we have any... Got no combo attacks left, because they're... Do light AoE. Alright, I think we're probably... For the best, stunning. Well, wait, we don't need to stun top dude, right? He's already getting pushed out. Do, however, want to stun at least this fucko. Right? So he's got the big AoE attack coming up. Not anymore, fuck you. So then that informs our attacks on this guy, I think. That's probably better, because that breaks a lot more of his armor. And then we can really make sure that he's nearly dead there with that attack. Okay, I'm good. Good with that. Because boom, he gets pushed out. Fuck you. Um, good attack there, good armor break for 12. And 
pretty good attacks here. Like 50, 104, another 52 there, and another one there. That was a good solid 2 hundo. Okay, that was alright. Now what do we do though? Cause I can, I can get rid of him. Make sure he goes the f way, right? This guy is mostly toast anyways. That guy's dead. And I'd really like to not That's only 25. Can we... We'd have to move him back by 40 plus. Do we have anything that does 40 plus? There's a 35. And then also... That. So that pushes him off entirely, right? Which is good. I think after everything else happens, they're not going to get a chance. So we might... May as well do... Small AoE, right? Helps us out a little bit. Everything's on fire. Enraged. I don't even know what enraged means. Does he get like stronger attacks or whatever? Fuck matter. He should be dead, I think, right? Or very close to. He's toast for sure. Uh bleeding and burning, etc. Okay. I think he's dead no matter what. Uh, let's make sure he gets pushed back a little bit. He's mostly going to be toast no matter what, and he's going to die there, so that's great. That's good. Oh, he's weak against... What was that, a normal attack? Uh, maybe check. What's he weak against? Oh, concussion damage. Okay, right, 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 right. And pyro. Okay. That's even better. All right, so he's toast no matter what. Okay, that's good stuff. We'll have full fury going out of this, and folks are mostly alive, except for Budget Han Solo yet again. One twenty level up juice, though, really good. Um. Might be best off getting her to level 8. And then whatever equips we get from here. Level 8's level 9. Whoa. Mmm. Doesn't have the health steal on it, though. Like, that's kind of the, the big problem here. So maybe we do. I think this dude's got flurry attacks. So additional attacks, additional damage from that, I guess against shield is pretty good. Otherwise, we could do the weapon, which it's only these two, right? So it would have to be this one. That no longer has shield steel, but it's additional fury, and it penetrates armor, which is good. And it flicks chilled, which I think is a slowdown, right? Ugh. Damn. Like, there's... not anything that's particularly stand out here. This is a level 9 one regardless. Heavy attacks execute 15 seconds. I don't think our... He just has any heavy attacks. Like, that's the deal, though. So that's probably a non-issue. That's probably a no-go regardless. A plus three three gen is pretty fucking good. But we've already got enough other things that do that, which makes it kind of an eh. Then we've got... Additional shield damage is pretty good. Plus, we could give that to him. Which I think he uses a lot of his normal flurry attack thing, whatever the fuck it is, right? 
So that seems like maybe the the most beneficial. Let's do it. Okay. And then what are we at for like level up juices here? 139 all across the board. Okay. And then I think we're at Oh, plus we got some more money out of that too. That's great. Um, and whatever this is, I guess it's probably just flavor text, yeah. Uh, okay, is there anything else, like, laying around that we can grab? No. Okay, no extra little villa bobs, that's fine. Okay, so then I think our opening play then on day three is to go get this guy, since we are now mostly level eights, right? Everybody's level eights. Okay, so we're on even keel. Even footing with this dude, we'll be fine. So one, probably two, we could even maybe go try to fight this guy. That would be a hell of a, that'd be a hell of a fight. Um, the other option is maybe to circle back up around here, right? Because we'll get this. Oh, we'll need to do number two here regardless, I think, just to get over here. If we do the unlock, then we could go up here and get the shield boost. Or we could go over here, try to fight this guy, and get whatever equipment that is. That might be a better play. So one, two, three, and then hope that our... It's supposed to be not any... There wasn't like a free health refill around here, huh? Or maybe there was one, but I just didn't go to that area. No, maybe not. There was an armor, there was a shield. There wasn't a health. Hmm. Unfortunate. But alright, let's camp for the night. Think about what we're gonna do on day three. Okay, if we go on the basis that we're probably not gonna get either the health or either the shield or the armor thing, we'd probably be best off trying to boost that stuff back up. And especially for Budget Han Solo there, he is nearly toast the way it is. So where's our helibits? There's our helibits. 50% is a pretty good heal a bit for one point. There's also this. Oh no, that doesn't heal. Uh, that does health, health damage. Uh, no. Where's the where's our other healing? Well, where's our free shit first? Hey, remember that time we murdered that guy? Yeah, let's remember that again. Um, and then also this. Oh, we're close to... Close to level 2 relationship there. So that'll be another combo attack unlocked. Ooh. Auto health heal 5 per round? Ooh. Uh, that seems pretty good. That is cheap, too. Real cheap. We'll think about that. Um, what else do we have for, like, healing shit, though? Cause we're okay, so here oh here's the full armor repair. Oh, he's only got five armor the way it is. But that so that would be best probably spent on our Aegis. That gets all our armor back. It's only one. And then probably a heal a bit on Budget Han Solo here. That's also one, so that's two accounted for. There's a 50% armor heal. I guess at this point we're probably... We're looking at recovery as maybe the best go of things here. So that might be good there to get his health a little bit back. That's also only one. Alright, let's start with that. And then we'll do, uh, there's the 100% armor run back there. 
And also the 50% heal there. Good choices all the way around, I think. All right, so now we've got two points left. Really want to unlock that combo attack with our Robo Commando there. What does he have? This, armor defense and crit damage. That seems pretty good. But also an armor repair, which is interesting. Need that. Attacks, debuff, defense. Oh, that's only a one. Do we have any other ones that might be interesting? Auto shield regen. Oh wait, what was the other, where was the other is there a one all on one of these? E yeah, this one here. Uh, auto health heal. That might help us out a bit. And then we can use the uh, tax cause bleeding might be good too. That would be enough for that. And what was the other one that he had otherwise? Uh, defense debuffs. I think I like the bleeding better. Even though I think that's blocked by armor and shield. Well, either way. Let's do that, and then we'll do the... The all thing with, uh, what's his nuts? you guys. Could have had you any time. It was a close change. I guess I filled with Cyclopses. <laughs> right? Uh, okay, so there's our combo attack. Shock and awe. Damn, it's only a single target one. Unfortunate, but that's a big fucking attack. 283 and 255? Shit. Plus it's pretty cheap, only 10 fury. I, mm, okay. Into that. Into that quite a bit. Uh, all right, so then we're back to probably this one, the auto heal, which benefits four out of the five, well, three out of the five people, I guess, yeah? Let's do it. Seems good. Alright. Good stuff. Okay, so now our options are one, possibly two there. Unlock shit and then decide what we're gonna do with number three. Oh, this would be a hell of a fight here, but, um, it might be worth it. It might be worth it to get that. And then we would have one final camp out before the big bad. Okay. Let's make that our plan for now. We'll be fighting this level 8, which I think everybody's level 8 now, so it's not that big a deal now. We'll get some equips. Uh, it's 5 on 4. Five on four, and we have to be careful how we do this, so... Ah, oh, right. Just this. Like, we could just wipe one... Okay, so we can't target just anybody, which is unfortunate. I guess that would be maybe a bit too powerful if we did it that way. Um, option is to then maybe stun this motherfucker out of existence here. Uh Okay. Hmm. I feel like if we try to delay this a turn. Is anybody doing an AoE here? No. It's like two and two and then Okay, that's probably the worst. This is the worst turn that we're gonna have, probably. But if we can at least get one of them out of here entirely. We could do just a AoE most shields get the fuck out of here, right? And then ensure that 
because what's that going to do? 55 plus 28, how much does he have entirely? 300. Uh, would love to... Maybe try to delay this a turn. Just realistically, 108 plus 50, like uh, 150, 160 is a pretty good slam. Just right away at the start of a turn. So we'll think about that. Alternative is maybe just doing this in such a way as to delay things enough. Okay, so our big boom slam is really... Oh, that's not enough, huh? 35 isn't enough there? Yeah, we would need at least one more attack there. So who's the... Okay, it's the sniper dude. That's kind of a... Kind of an a-hole here. Um, but we could do that. Get him off the... Er, get him off the timeline there. Uh, I'm sure that that dude maybe is almost out of here. I don't want to do that yet, because that's an instant. God, even just one attack on this dude almost murders him, which is fun and cool. So realistically, then, with the attacks that are remaining on my folks, what what's the worst that's going to happen here? Frontliner is toast, no matter what. So it's just this dude and this dude, and they're distributed attacks between them. This guy, I think. Uh, no, because then it'll be this dude as well. So she'll take a very minor armor and health bomb. Which is probably fine. Alternatively, I could... break this dipshit off the timeline. I think he's toast no matter what. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the way to go. And just make sure he doesn't go next time. Let everything else kind of fall where it does. Alright, that's good there. I forgot that she has some armor absorb on her, which is great. Really kind of helps us out. So I think this fucker is just toast. Um, after our other dude goes. So whatever. Oh no. Uh, a little bit of health. Uh. Yeah, I think this fucker's gone. A little bit of a zip zap here. Okay, that's a pretty big zip zap. Um, but alright, he's toast. Other dude up there is nearly fucking toast. Now it's gonna be a matter of, well, can we make all these fuckers not go this round? I think so, probably. Um, the best way to deal with that Overwatch is to just do that, right? Which leaves us to do, okay, there's a kill there. Do I want to bother with a big shot there? Okay, we can do that. That guy's up there is toast. If we do this, cancel overwatch there. Right? That other dude's dead. And then it's uh, big boy, which is... That's a pretty big hit. I'd rather not have to deal with that. Can we make sure he doesn't do that? Not quite, huh? We'd have to probably do a stun, which we can do. Probably, maybe. Or we could do big booms. Oh, no, we can't because, uh... Ugh. 
really not have a stun that'll go against them. Damn, the... Well, hold on a second. Let's, uh... Cancel that for now. We have a different way... Okay, we can... Maybe make sure he doesn't go this time. With that, and that's Sunder, perhaps. There we go. That breaks him off the timeline there. Now we just need to make sure that this fucker doesn't get to go. And because he's gonna be dead. There. That works. Just needed to rearrange shit a little bit. Boom. Eat shit. Then boom. You, you go back now. And then... Boom. You get off this timeline. Thank you. And then, uh, boom, 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 Uh, bye-bye to your shields. And then, now it's five on two. Excellent. Ah, he gets a cloak. Bastard. Uh, what does that mean, though? Who is he attacking? Ouch! Ugh. That's kind of not great. All right, so now we might need to do some slightly clever things here. We could do big slam there to stun him. Can we just get him out of here? There, we could do that. Just get him entirely the fuck out. Uh, which for 10 Fury is extremely cheap. Hot damn. That's a hell of an attack. Boom. Get your ass out. So now I'm curious, like, what can I do here? I guess AoE, but that doesn't stagger at all, which sucks ass. Um, so who is he attacking? Is he attacking that guy? What if we guard? That's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a big attack. So really, I can't do anything about this if I defend. Oh, wait. That's still going to be a big attack. I don't want you to defend, buddy. Stop that. All right. Uh... Okay. But if I charge shields, that's what? Plus 96. And then guard? That's better. Yeah, that makes that a non-issue, and then we plant explosives. So next turn, this fucker's pretty much toast. I guess we can just do uh, an AoE whatever. Bonk. Now his armor's gone. And he's on fire. And he's gonna take a quarter of this damage, right? Yeah, which is 15. <laughs> Great. Everybody gets five back. Um, plus she gets a little bit of health back there too, right? It's 40 health back, so that's even better. I think we're gonna kill shot this no matter what, so. Make sure it happens the way it should, huh? That's probably the kill there, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so we got a little bit of, like, incidental healing going on there. That's fine and cool. Oh, right, that was a... a bigger dipshit we just murdered. Very good. Forgot. Kinda forgot that that was the thing. Okay, so that's no problem. Uh, we've got... Enough level up juice for anybody. So if this is a level 9 thing... Oh, a better S word, you say, huh? There's a... Okay, there's a health steal. Plus... One quarter shield and armor penetration. And does vulnerable 8. That seems pretty good. Plus a health steal. Oh, a health steal seems pretty... Overpowered, but then we would be giving up 30% damage, boost, armor steal, and additional fury gain, which is 
Oh, which is troublesome. Um, the other big thing would be this, which is now Shield Stealer. Also, much better armor break. But then we'd be giving up health steal. And then probably the other. Ah, uh, then the other one 40% damage boost. And also crit boost by 15%. <sighs> Hot damn. That might be the best boost we can hope for here. Because otherwise, I mean, this dude's only got whatever that is the pyro rifle fucking level one bullshit. Ah, I guess I gotta go with this one. Yeah. So now he's doing much more than he ever was before, right? Oh, and there's our... There's the weirdo thing kind of taking effect there. Uh, does reset location work here or no? I don't know that it does. No, because then it kind of just... Yeah, all right. Just need to save and reload. I don't know. We've run into that like probably three or four times by now. Oh well. Pretty easy to get back into it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think our options are pretty limited now, though. If we need to go this way, no matter what, if we do this fight here be a pretty soft touch to level 7 only. But then we're gonna have an unlock, so then we're gonna have a chance to fight this fucker, which has good equips behind it, or we can go up here get the shield thing, or go up here get this money, or go down here and fight this basic bitch fight. Um, yeah, that's probably a non-starter. A non Probably gonna be fighting this guy. <laughs> we'll take the risk on. Um, okay, so either way, I think we're fighting this fucker here. Take the whatever, 30 damage or blah blah blah. Oh no. Um, and now it's five on four, which is fine. Um, yeah, we've got plenty of time to work with this, so. Alright, so there goes that guy. God, even if we were to... Oh, it's that dude there. Push him back, like... Real quick, like, there. So it almost have to be, like... What else do we have as far as, like, what can we do to... Okay. This... Okay, this guy needs to not go this turn. Because that's, a. Uh... That's a big attack. 123 is a big attack. Um, so what can we do to get rid of that? Can we just do a... Just a basic stun? Where's the... Wait, wait, wait. Where... Here. This one. Oh, we can't... That's right, because it doesn't target... It can't target everybody. Which makes sense, because it's really... It's a really cheap attack. So, alright. That's... That's fine. What, el what else do we have that can perhaps... Okay, let me see what we do here. Okay, that gets rid of that. That's probably the best. Um, then... We can get rid of that. And that leaves two others. Which there's one slight one there, which he's only firing at that, that's fine, whatever. So maybe we focus down the front dipshit. Okay, there's a kill immediately there. Get rid of him. Um, if we do then this, which is, oops, that's an instant, whatever. Fuck you, I guess. Uh, and then whatever we have on our last dude that can hit that guy, it's gonna be, oh, nothing really. So then we roll the dice and see what our what our AoE hits, essentially, right? Fuck it. So I think after this set of things, we're like not even in any position to be threatened. Did 
There he goes. That fucker, I think, is toast entirely. Right? And then this guy gets to go, which, you know, whatever. She'll take that hit on the chin, no problem. And there, boom, bam, boom. Oh, each, a, each individual, like, little bop of that targets something random. That's interesting. I didn't realize that. Okay, yeah. So three attacks there. Random targets each time. Interesting. That's kind of fun. I like that. Um, all right. So then we move that dipshit back. Move that dipshit off entirely. Um... That guy's not gonna die, which is unfortunate. That guy will, though. So. Uh, and then we can do just a stun there. It's probably for the best. So that gets rid of him. Uh, and then there's that just guy left, which he's probably toast the way to- like, either way. Whoever's not dead here is gonna die, so probably that guy. And he might be toast otherwise from this shot, right? Yeah, okay, so he's toast anyways. Bye-bye. More or less. Oh, uh, yeah, okay, so he's gone. And then I think next attack will murder other dude there, right? Oh, no, he's gonna attack that one. You know what? That's fine, too. That's fine, too. Uh, oh, he gets to go immediately, huh? Well, we'll see about that. Hmm. If I have a, a stun, we can maybe not let him go? Yeah, we could do that. Uh, do we have anything faster? Got that. Could redirect. 34 plus 25. How much does he have left? 198, huh? That's gonna do 50 some? 59? Plus. Uh, looks like 83. Be 130 something. It's not quite enough. Do we have anything else that goes instantly? And we could guard, right? Who is the attack? Oh, that's everything. That's everybody. That's a big AoE. I don't like it. Uh... Maybe we could burn a big combo attack. I don't know if I want to do that. Probably the cheapest thing would be to... Stun and deal with them next turn. Yeah, let's do that. Because then we can, uh, and, and maybe most of this is kind of a non-issue, because this guy is probably toast no matter what we do. So there's a kill shot there. Then he's toast there, and then he's more or less, yeah, okay, that's a pretty big non-issue. He's toast. Whoever gets first attack here gets the kill. Oh, maybe not. All right, never mind. <laughs> okay, pretty easy. And a bunch of money. Hey, I'm into that. Uh, okay. Now we've got 34 level up juice. We're gonna get at least two folks to level nine here before. Uh, before the big bad, right? It's just a matter of who... Who really needs it. Who really needs it, because we're gonna try to fight that fucker, I think. I guess we could just unlock this to see what this does. Does this change my decision at all? We could go down here. Oh, there's the heal! Ooh. That might change my decision. How's everybody doing? Oh, no, they're mostly... Mostly alive, right? Everybody's at least three quarters.
Plus, I think our does our protag have uh, health steal here? Not anymore, right? She used to. Yeah, this used to be the health steal. Ah, damn. But everybody else is kind of kind of okay with what they have, right? Eh. Hmm. Yeah, we could probably forego that then. I guess it's a, it'll depend on... Ah, it's all gonna hinge on how this fight goes, really. We'll get the equips behind it. That'll inform how we spend the camp out, really, if we need to, like, focus on recovering or if we can do a lot of buffs and shit, too. Well, either way, we're going this way. Fuck it. Oh, I should've leveled up. Whoops. Well, it'll be fine. <laughs> it's five on three. We'll be fine. Um. Okay. Mm -mm oh, it'll be fine. Oh, wow. Everybody's doing an AOE, huh? Uh. Okay. <laughs> Let's make sure that doesn't happen. That's the only dude we can target there, huh? Oof, uh. Okay, well... Okay, well we need to make sure none of these fuckers gets to go. That needs to be like, oh hey, we burn a fucking combo and erase somebody from existence we can't do because top dude there is uh, pretty beefy so maybe we burn this one instead and do a stun he's weak versus combo which not bad all right can we minus budget Han solo and pro tag can we uh, get those other two the other front two off of this timeline here Okay, there's that one. Um, and there's that one. Alright. And then we get essentially a free whatever. It's probably that guy there. And then our option really is to exploit the combo weakness here and make sure he doesn't get to go. Yeah, that's more or less the play, I think, so... There we go. Okay. Did some decent damage. That's more than a third of his health. Really, the only thing we're gonna need to worry about is... getting as much fury back as we can. We're already at about half seeds or so. Okay, now the problem is gonna be... What are they doing? <laughs> Still got a big AoE coming from that guy. Can we make that not a thing? We can. Like that. Uh, but... Problem is going to be like none of our other attacks are going to be fast enough. So, do we burn another big combo attack to erase this motherfucker from existence? And then kind of work it from there. So, without Robot Commando and Protag, can we do anything else that would perhaps? Murder at least one more. Jeez, that's a hell of an attack. 142. Okay, she's got the shield to take that as long as she goes before he does. Which I think we can make that happen, because he's, uh... 
Yeah. As long as she goes kind of first-ish. Ensure that he doesn't go. Which is fine. What can we do about this other fucker, though? We, uh... Sir. Slightly larger attack there. He's doing an AoE too, isn't he? But what was our other attack here? Shock and awe. Oh, that was to get him out of here just entirely. So whoever else gets to go then... You know, that's a, that's a cheap, just get the fuck out of here attack. So yeah, let's do it. Then we've got three others that can now target other dipshit in the front. Which should be enough to now get him out of here. So if we do that, that that's instant. And she just needs to really go before he does anyways, so... Okay, that's not quite a kill shot, but it's pretty close. There's the kill shot there. Then I can just make sure that this guy takes a tap. That opens up our last choice a little bit, I think. Oh, that was our last choice. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, he, he goes, does only shield damage, right? No problem. Easy. And then this fucker's gone, and now it's just... Now five on one. Uh, which should be pretty easy at this point, right? So there's boom. And can we do Big Boom Slam here? Yep. Rage versus Heavy is not going to matter. It's, this is going to be kill shots all over the place. Honestly, I don't think we took any... No health damage, maybe a little bit of armor damage in there somewhere, but... Pretty good fight against this level 9 dipshit. More or less free. And then whatever equips we get from out of that, it's good too. Okay, unfortunately, that's the last thing we've got. So let's see, uh, what do folks have? What are we at? We're out level eights across the board. <sighs> Whoa, look at that. Uh, half again damage for light attacks. And flurries go right away, not bad. Oh. Additional 10 seconds stagger, and then bleeding 8 on everything? Oh, 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 fuck me. Pretty good. Gets rid of our extra fury gain, armor steal, and 30% damage buff across the board, though. Uh, uh. Otherwise, there's this kind of thing that anybody can use, which is hell of good armor. Additional health, which, I mean, that's pretty good, but if we're thinking good here, I don't think Protag has any light attacks. Does she? Oh, can I look at her attacks from here? No, I can't. Can I? Damn. We're just one action shy of looking at our attacks. Alright, but this can be used by anybody, right? So does anybody have... Let's 
So what, what does this do? More... Okay, 50% damage for light attacks. Flurries execute instantly. This might be good for... For this dude, right? Because his... Oh, well, no. His flurry attacks... Uh, flurry attacks are different from light attacks, so that's not as good as I thought. So maybe it's the... Maybe it's the best for additional armor. And whoever needs it would... And maybe... Like, either of our frontliners really could take it. I do like the auto-regen shields, though. <laughs> like, them having auto-regen shields is pretty fucking good. Um, so anybody else could take it, it would be something. Level 8 S word is tempting, but she's already got a really good S word. The other option is this one, which is. Yeah, I don't think she doesn't have a light attack. Does she have a flurry? I don't think she has a flurry attack either, so that's probably a, a non starter, I think. No matter what. Unless we wanted to give this to our Aegis, because she has a light attack, right? So that would do half again more damage, and then I don't know that she's got a flurry attack, though. So that's, yeah, that's not very good. So I think it's the best. The best is probably the best all the way around. So we can give it to one of our back row folks. And maybe that promotes them to the front row, too, because that's additional armor that lets them take a pretty serious hit without eating shit, really. Um, okay, you know what? We'll take it. We'll decide who gets to have it. I'll pick up any other incidental stuff, and then we're kind of at time tonight anyways. Lots of level-up juice. That's good. Uh, anything more? Oh, that's it. Okay. Um, and then we'll come at this fresh next time, I think, because we're at the big bad for Area 3. <sighs> okay, who who's the lucky one that's getting the best? Maybe Budget Han Solo? I think he's the well no, I also give it to him. That's what? Plus 24 armor. And 46 health. Jeez, that's a lot. Plus 24 armor is pretty pretty wild. Oh, except it doesn't Oh, he doesn't have armor to begin with, so that doesn't take effect, I guess? Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, so maybe it's best on our dude here. Yeah. So now he's he's almost like good for front row. It's just a shame his shield is so shitty. All right, I really don't need like the shitty rifle here, right? Sell that for a bucko. There's anything else we need to equip to folks here. And he's got kind of uh, like middle grade weapons here, which is unfortunate. But we're gonna once we clear the third area here, we've got a bunch of money. So whoever gets lucky on the shop rolls here is really gonna get lucky on the shop rolls. All right, but we got enough level up juice for maybe 404, huh? So it'll be 139. 278. Damn, we're just a little bit shy of three level ups out of this. So we're gonna have to pick and choose who gets the levels here. It's just, at this point, it's just relationship boosters and health boost. Which, as the two front runners, are like the easy choices, right? 
They'll take the most bots. Plus, that opens up our Deflect 2. What is Deflect 2? 35% damage reflect. I like that. And then what's her top one? Chop. Another heavy attack. Probably replaces Cleave, I imagine. 126 plus 82. Oh, this is the same there, actually. Is it faster? Does it do more... Okay, it does more stagger. And slightly more armor break. Okay, that's less exciting. But we'd probably save the level up juice for a level 9 on somebody else anyway, so... We'll see what happens there. Okay. Um, then that puts us at time for tonight. So, we'll come at this fresh... Next week, we'll have a camp out before the big bad. And hopefully wipe the floor with it. Whatever it happens to be. I don't remember what it is in Area 3 here. Um, but that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30pm CDT. It'll be Shmup Book Club. Uh, so Ginga Force or Universe. Or... <laughs> Uh, another Ginga something something Sapphire game. I don't remember the full title of it because it's like five words in sequence. I can't remember that shit. Uh, but for Schmuck Book Club, that's tomorrow. Uh, Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT, it'll be uh, Long Clay. So more Talus Principle 2. We've got more of the DLC puzzles to take care of. And then next Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back here with Star Renegades to maybe finish off this second run. We seem to be approaching the end game here. Uh, so we'll see if we don't eat shit this time uh, due to bad choices. Um, but, you know, time will tell. We'll see, we'll see. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.